Right, what's the plan? I met her on a Saturday uh -huh. She said it was her birthday uh -huh. Asked if I was thirsty uh -huh. Just my time uh -huh. I you never seen me do that before. What's up guys, Liam here and welcome back to LSJ TV. So today's video is being started off by us cleaning out some of the dirty side of the home gym. So the way the home gym works is if we just pan over there, we have two sections to it. It's a double garage, right? That's the clean side that you guys are used to seeing and you see a lot of the time. And this is the side that I try and avoid, purely because it looks like this. Now actually, believe it or not, it looks a little bit better than it did around about 10-15 minutes ago. Um, but me and the old man have been clearing out and we are getting a new piece of gym equipment. Not yet, but we're kind of just prepping for it. So today's video is going to be starting off with the clear out. It's going to be a good one. Drop it a like and a comment down below. Let's get it started. If I would have known the things she do, I would have told myself to cut her Right, everyone, this is a Bart's Double Trouble. I think I've shown, have I shown it on the channel before. Um, don't think you have. Mm. It's my childhood favorite thing. When me, Joe, Cam, the cameraman, were out the back on the trampoline, we used to run out, these were one pound, and you get normal ice cream with a rocket lolly shoved in it and sauce, one pound. Great. You can't beat it. That's your boring old 99, Dad. Yeah, that'll do me. <laughs> so this has been clogging up space in the garage for how long? A decade? Two decades? Yeah, your lifetime. Yeah, so my, my entire life... What? We've not used it since then. No. So we've not used this since I've been alive. I'm 21. And it's been here taking up loads of the garage. You finally managed to convince Mum to get rid of it, didn't you, Dad? I think what we're going to do, right, I think what we're going to clear all of these out shift some of that into there, get rid of these, and shove some stuff down there. That's gonna make no sense to you, but don't worry, we know what we're doing. Can you clear all of them out before? Because then, if we end up moving this one over there, you're gonna to have to empty it because it's all there and then shift it over there. Whereas, if they're all empty, you can see whether they can fit in there and get rid of both of them. Okay, cool. I met her on a Saturday, uh -huh. she said it was a birthday. Uh -huh. Asked if I was thirsty uh, Just my time Then let's get these now <laughs> How did that even get in there, let alone get out? Ah, the scale x tray. Been in the cupboard for 20 years no, that's more like a decade. The rocking horse is 20 years. This is more like a decade. Are we ready? Go on then. Three, two, one. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> if I would have known the things she'd do, I would have told myself to cut her nose. But baby, don't watch it. Right, now we're gonna do something with all of this. Let's 
this one, that one, that one, and that one's got no door. A heavy downpour is suspending play. First rain we've had in weeks. <laughs> weeks! Couldn't be asked to do any more anyway. <laughs> Smashed it. The morning started off with um, a trip to Sainsbury's uh, because there was no food in the house for no particular reason, just it's a fairly common occurrence uh, here back at home anyway. But if you could excuse the building site that is the home gym right now uh, for the reasons that you guys saw earlier on in the video, I wanted to talk about today's topic. But before I do, I wanted to just quickly thank you guys for all of your support on the graduation episode one. Uh, as you guys know, this is episode two. I'll get into that in a minute. But the 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 day as a whole was just amazing. The, your support of I can't, I, I kind of like I I, I don't I don't know what to say. Just thank you. Just just thank you. But you guys see the title, um, and that is what I want to talk about. I want to have a kind of, you know, a one-to-one -one chat. I want to want to explain uh, what this series is about, what it's going to entail, all that kind of stuff. But for two, explain my feelings, because I kind of tried to do that in the last video, but didn't really do it properly. So it's Sunday right now, right? And so obviously last night was Saturday night, and I was kind of just sat there on my own, uh, you know, mum and dad had gone to bed, there was no Charlotte, there was no Jake, so like, or anyone like that. There was no one there to sort of, you know, have a laugh with and go out with and like I would usually do for, you know, the last three years. There was no Saturday night antics, if you like, you know, usually I'd be getting ready by that time when I was kind of sat, sat there, you know, with a Kofferberg light, <laughs> just sat there chilling on my own. Um, Usually by that time I'd be showering up, getting ready to go out to the SU on Saturday, one of our favourite nights that we went to pretty much every single week of university. Um, but that just wasn't the case. And that was the first time that properly that hadn't really been the case. And it had hit me, if you like. Um, and uh, Because until that point I've had the option to go back to uni. Still do, I have the flat for another two or three weeks. Um, but then that's it, that's that completely done. Um, and so that was after the first Saturday after graduation and it really hit home that, well, shit, <laughs> this is my life now. You know, not, not that it's a bad thing. I mean, I'm very lucky to be in the situation that I'm in, but the, the, the lifestyle that comes along with university in terms of just going out at the click of a finger on a Saturday night or fuck it, just on a Tuesday if you feel like it, I've become so accustomed to that that it just felt odd and bizarre and kind of, I mean, not for very long. I mean, I'm over it now. I, I sat there and I was kind of feeling sorry for myself a little bit on, on, on Saturday night. I was like, oh, you know, I felt like I should be doing something. On the flip side of that though, I was being very productive. I was on my phone, I was editing this video, I was thinking about future projects which are going on up here, which again, we'll get to in a minute, and oh my God, am I excited for them. But I was, I just, I just kind of, I felt sorry for myself and I, I had a little, you know, half hour slump and and then that was that really. But the reason I wanted to share this sort of and make it, you know, the title of today's video is because it's a very important topic and the, the series name Graduation kind of, I think, needs some explanation um, and essentially what I'm going to do is show you everything, my transition from university to working life. Like, I, I'm, I'm technically, I'm, you know, a working man now. Like, I, I start tomorrow, in fact. So I wanted to provide some sort of context as to the name of the series, what you guys can expect from the series, and all that kind of stuff. So in the past, I've looked to Body Power for, for inspiration for my series names, with consistency, with growth, but now I, I didn't need Body Power for my inspiration. My, my inspiration was university. And I thought, I don't know anybody else out there that can look back on their university experience 
the same way that I can. Now my experience is completely unique and the way that I've captured it on camera is also completely unique. You can see the growth, like go back to my old videos, I invite you guys to actually do that, to see the sort of, the growth and you know, the consistency of the uploads for one, the two series names. And they're, they're terrible, the old videos are terrible, absolutely shocking. And people always say to me, Liam take them down if you're like, as if I should be embarrassed by it. But no, I have an entire series with about 80 to 100 odd videos in it entitled Growth. And that is my growth, you know. And every single thing has had a meaning and an inspiration and that's usually come from body power. But to be honest, the name graduation came from you guys and from university. Um, my university wouldn't have been the same without you guys my university experience, and so I don't want that to change post-university. And to talk you through my mindset, really, it was kind of, it was a no-brainer, really. I kind of decided about six months ago that I wanted to call this series graduation, and that I was going to make very clear that I am the person that's graduating, and I kind of wanted to make it very clear that what you guys can expect. You, you can expect a person who's just been to university sharing everything post-university. So I'm going to show you the transition from what from uni to work, the transition from having a lot of spare time to not a lot of spare time, from, from how easy it's been to make my videos to now how difficult it's, it's actually going to be. And I'd be lying if I said I knew exactly how I was going to show you that because uh, I don't know. I mean, I wasn't... If I'm being completely honest, I wasn't ready for university to finish. If I could, I would live that lifestyle forever because it was just so enjoyable. It allowed me to make videos. You know, uh, I just loved it so much um, that I wasn't ready for it to finish. And at the end of graduation episode one, I actually uncontrollably just burst into tears. It took 21 and a half hours of work to create that episode. And my God, am I thankful that I did it because look at the video, you know, it turned out great. And now I can look back at that in 10 years time, 20 years time. And you know, when I'm 80, you know, I can look back at that video. Um, but I just, I don't even know how to kind of explain the feeling. It was just uncontrollable emotion that just came, <laughs> that just came pouring out of me. and. I never really had that before, um, and I will show you guys that clip. Not right now, I'll show you when when the time's right. I'll know within myself when the time is right to kind of show that. I'm sure you guys can understand and appreciate that, but I, just, I, I wasn't really sure of what was going on, and I finished the video and I was like, boom, that's it. It's done, like it's officially done. And it just hit me, so. Um, that's another thing you can expect with this series, like me showing you guys how I'm dealing with that and how I'm progressing forwards and moving and, you know, staying positive because I like to think I preach very positive vibes, you know, I'm a pretty happy positive guy, you know, the majority of the time. So, um, yeah, it's, it's going to be an interesting one. It's going to be the most meaningful series, if you ask me, um, and I'm excited and I hope you guys are too. So thank you for watching today, guys. If you have enjoyed, please drop a like, comment down below, and share the video. Subscribe if you are new, um, and <laughs> that's, that's, that's that. I'm getting a bit emotional now, so I'm just gonna cut it off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, please drop a like, all that kind of stuff. Really helps a lot. Much love to you guys. Together we will grow. I'll see you in the next video.